So it looks like Kodak Black woke up with Boosie on his mind. You know, talking about Kodak just can't get rid of the fact and let the fact go that Lil Boosie tried to get the screech to turn their back against Kodak Black. And what I mean by that, obviously Boosie came out whenever Kodak Black did that song with 6 9 And he pretty much told everybody, man, why I wouldn't even work with him no more, man. I'm talking about I got, I'm getting calls from people in prison that saying they disappointed in Kodak Black. You know what I'm talking about? I got BG done told me something about Kodak Black that I ain't even know about Kodak Black. That's going to be a bum to the world. So if y'all still working with Kodak Black after he done worked with a certified rat, then I don't know what to tell y'all. Well, it looks like Kodak Black has now issued another statement out to Boosie, you know, to, well, out to the public of his renaming of Boosie. You know, about. So instead of calling Boosie Boosie, I'm going to tell y'all what he said his new name is. Is right after the intro. Welcome back to Key Talk Media. This is your host, Key Talk. Check it out, man. All right. You already know. Key Talk Society, go ahead and like the video so we can get the story started. Anyways, so pretty much. He's came out now. Kodak Black came out and said Boosie's new name is Pussy. You know I'm talking about. He took to his Instagram and said. Pussy a clown. So obviously when they calling him Pussy instead of Boosie, Boosie's the name, but he intermixed the P word, which I'm sure y'all know what that is. You know, I'm talking about the P word that's 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 like another word for the word cat. If you know what I'm saying, I can keep going down the line on what we else we call that P word. But he kind of mixed that P word in with Boosie's name. So now he's just got Pussy for it and he pretty much called him a clown. Uh and he also posted a video of another guy pretty much talking about uh that Boosie really hasn't done nothing for the black community. And I guess his ideologies are just destroying and further destroys the black community. Uh, and like I say, man, it's the streets, you know, talking about it. And what's happening right now is like, I guess Kodak Black made a move to where it will create a divide, you know, talking about it. it's breaking barriers of the street rules uh, versus the music business. You see what I'm saying? Like, as of right now, well, up until this point, what we say up until this point, a lot of artists have been following the street codes uh, as far as even with the music side even though we know there's a lot of people been snitching and ratting and telling and just breaking the street code period i mean it really ain't even no code because nobody really follows it anymore you know what i'm talking about maybe the older generation was sticking to you know what they call the code but as of now these new the new days everybody's like a free for all do what's gonna get you paid you know what i'm talking about whatever it is whatever it is but anyways how do y'all feel about what Kodak Black said? Do y'all feel like this is going to escalate the tension between the two? Uh, or do you agree with what Kodak Black is saying? That pussy, you know what I'm talking about, is acting like a clown. Um, or y'all feel like, nah, Kodak Black just trying to run and hide the fact that he did a song with a rat, which is breaking a street code. And speaking of breaking a street code for doing certain stuff. I, like I said a while ago, I said this on my Instagram, uh, which is Key Talk Media. I don't know, you know, if y'all follow it, y'all. If you don't follow, you definitely need to follow the Instagram and Key Talk Media because we be lit on there. Uh, but you know, I said a while ago, I was like, it's gonna get to a point to where the black community is have to, is going to have to go to war, but first is going to have to go to war with itself and the ideologies that, 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 that they're currently sticking to in order to push the black community and the culture forward. And obviously everybody knows that a lot of the discrete rules and stuff that, that, that are tied to it are, does negatively affect like the community as a whole. You see what I'm saying? Um, you know, that's why it's a lot of like quietness when it comes to a lot of that stuff and a lot of, okay, don't say this, don't say that. Because like I say, obviously everybody knows that, you know, as a whole, the rules of that affects the, 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 the majority of the community a lot. So, you know, it, it will have to come a time if the black community decides to like, uh, do better with itself and push itself forward, that there is going to be a domestic, which is an inner war within the black community. And it does look like uh, some of the rappers are spearheading it. Kodak Black just did something that's violating other street rules. He's standing on that. You know what I'm talking about? Uh, I think the song still did like it actually did more views than Drake's song did in a day and Travis song, Scott's song did in a day. Uh, but like I say, I'm just here to watch it all and let y'all know exactly what's going down on the media screens. Anyways, let me know some. Comment down below. Let me know what you think about this entire deal. I'm out.